In this video, we're going to learn how to convert a total number of inches into an equivalent number of feet and inches using Python. So for example, if we have 62 inches, the equivalent number of feet and inches is five feet and two inches. Now we can get these numbers by dividing the total number of inches by 12. So for example, 62 divided by 12 gives us five remainder two. And that makes sense because there's 12 inches in a foot. So five times 12 will give us 60 inches. And then two more inches would give us 62 inches total. So that's how the math works. Now Python has a function called divmod, which is going to return the quotient and the remainder of a division operation. So we'll use that. The first thing we'll do is prompt the user to enter the total number of inches. We'll have total inches is equal to, and we'll call the input function to prompt the user for the total number of inches. We'll have inches colon here. So the input function is going to prompt the user with the text inches colon, and the input function is going to return the string the user enters. What we'll do is convert that string to an integer number with int like this. Then we'll take the total inches and divide it by 12 using divmod. We'll have divmod and then total inches and we'll divide total inches by 12 by supplying 12 as the second argument to the function. Now divmod is going to return the quotient and the remainder in what's called a tuple. To store both of those values into separate variables, we can have feet comma inches is equal to the return tuple of divmod. And this will store the quotient into feet and the remainder into inches. We can then output the result. We could have print and we'll have the number of feet followed by the text feed, followed by the number of inches, followed by the text inches. And then if we save the program and try it out and enter in, let's say 62, we'll get here five feet, two inches, which is correct. So this is how we can find the equivalent number of feet and inches given a total number of inches in Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.